What is up guys, me like and today we are back in action playing Five Nights at Freddy's 3. So I did do a sequel video on Five Nights at Freddy's 2, and I'm actually going to do more. We're going to continue Five Nights at Freddy's 3 and 2. So uh, I just bought this today. I'm a little late to the hype train by like a day or two. Uh, but hopefully you guys enjoy it, and I'm playing this in perfect conditions where it's super dark in my room. I have no lights on. I have headphones on. So we're going to see how this, uh, how this uh, happens. Um, so, ooh, local amusement park is getting ready to scare your socks off with a new attraction based on the unsolved mysteries of Freddy's Fazbear Pizza. Featuring actual relics from the decades-old pizzeria, this new attraction is guaranteed... Okay. Uh, 12 a.m. first night. Nice. Okay, so this guy, I'm assuming he's going to talk a lot. <laughs> <laughs> oh god, that's uh, yeah, creepy. You've officially become part of the attraction. Uh, you'll be starring as so, the security guard. So apparently, so um, <laughs> apparently the there's like multiple them. things you, you know, gotta do in this version of Five Nights at Freddy's. I'm sorry I'm talking over this guy. I'll let him play and like you guys can hear the storyline. But apparently, uh, there's only one, uh, thing now that you have to defend against? I don't know. I don't know. We'll, we'll see. We found another set of drawings. Always nice. And a foxy head. <laughs> cosplay, that'd be a scary cosplay. Metal, though. So watch the fingers. Uh, uh, right now, the place is basically just, you know, flashing lights and spooky Hi. props. But I honestly thought we'd have more by now. Uh, we don't have something really cool by next week, so we may have to suit you up in a furry suit Hello. and make you walk around saying, boo. <laughs> uh, but, you know, like I said, we're trying to track down a good lead right now. So <laughs> that scares the crap out of me. Oh Some God! Dude, why do you have to talk so much, man? The most important thing you want to watch for is the ventilation. Look, this place will give you the spooks, man. And if you let that ventilation go off wide, then you'll start seeing some crazy stuff, man. Keep that air flowing. Okay, keep an eye on things, and we'll try to have something new for you tomorrow night. Oh, nice new stuff. I'm always super excited about new stuff. So we only have a couple minutes left. I'm pretty sure every hour is a minute, something like that. And uh, we have to get to the 6 a.m. to actually win the night. Uh, so apparently there's only one animatronic this time around. But there's other mechanics. I've watched some videos. There's other mechanics I don't fully understand. Um, like, I think we there's like some kind of... So here's the hallways. Uh, it's so weird that you have to choose between vent cams and hallway cams. I don't see anything yet, but, you know, this is night one, so I'm assuming there's not going to be really anything uh, happening. Now, it looks like there's no, like, power bar meters or anything like that, but I think uh, the ventilation can go offline. Like, right now, I just now, I guess, restarted it or something. I probably shouldn't have done that. Um, <laughs> but, yeah, the ventilation can go offline, and a bunch of other stuff can malfunction, and you have to reboot it. Um, I, don't, I guess, you you know, like, stuff comes out if you don't reboot it, boot it, maybe similar to, like, you know, the puppet mechanic in Five Nights at Freddy's 2. Um, but, yeah, let's just play and see what happens. We'll probably get through night maybe one or two tonight. I'm not sure. I think I might play Five Nights at Freddy's 2 after this as well, so we'll see how that... What... Oh, yes, we beat night one. Woot! So, uh, I'm, I'm happy about that. <laughs> uh. Okay, so we're going, we're here for night two. Oh, what's happening? What's happening? Uh, okay. W-S-A-D-I-C. So, I'm, I'm Freddy. 
I'm coming off the stage. Oh, I'm gonna p follow. Yeah, let's follow Purple Freddy. That sounds like a great idea. Okay, yeah, see you later, Freddy. Oh, wait, what's this? Can I pick this up? Ugh. No, I can't pick it up. I don't know what that was. Is he's like, is there like gun shooting or something? Or is that rain? Okay, so we're like in a party room right now. Uh, follow me. Okay, I'm following you, man. What, a little mice or something in tears? Air? Uh, no, 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 no. Okay, let's go over to the hot dog. This, okay, we, ah! Oh, okay, we're good. <laughs> we're good. <laughs> I think. Okay, so second night. Is there someone behind me? No, there's not. Okay. I feel like this is when my, my mother would come up and, like, scare me or something. Hey, man, okay. I have some awesome news for you. First of all, we found some vintage audio training cassettes. Dude, these are, like, prehistoric. I think they were, like, training tapes. Oh, God. For, like, other employees or something like that. So, I thought we could, like, have them playing, like, over the speakers as people walk through the attractions. That makes this feel legit, man. But I have an even better surprise for you. And you're not gonna believe this. We found one. A real one. Uh, 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 gotta go, man. Uh, well, well look, it, it's uh, in there somewhere. What's, what's right? happening? I'm sure you'll see it. Okay, I'll leave you with some of this great audio that I found. Talk to you later, man. Uh, later, dude. <laughs> Hello. Hello. Oh, God, it's this guy. Welcome to your new career as a performer slash it's this guy. No, I don't want to talk to this guy. A ventilation air. Vent okay, wait, 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 wait. Uh, yeah, let's reboot it. Nice. Okay. Good. Oh, oh, what's happening? What's happening? What's going on? Oh, no. What's the red light mean? Let's reboot it all. Let's just reboot everything. It's fine. It's fine, we're gonna die. Animatronic form. For ease of operation, the animatronics are set to turn and walk towards sound to This is an easy and hands-free approach to making sure the animatronics stay where they are. Dude, I can't even see anything with these cameras. These cameras suck so much balls. To change the animatronics to suit mode, insert and turn firmly the hand crank provided by the manufacturer. Turning the crank will recoil and compress the animatronic parts around the sides of the suit. Providing room to climb inside. Please make sure the spring locks are fast and tight to ensure the animatronic devices remain fixed. We will cover this in more detail in tomorrow's session. Remember to smile. You are the face of Freddy Fazbear's pizza. <laughs> so, I'm not really sure what I should be doing. I'm guessing I did okay by rebooting the whole system. That's what probably all the red flashing lights were. But I'm not really sure what the mechanics of this are because it kind of made sense last time. You like you had to keep everything charged and you know you had to rewind the thing and that made sense. Right now I'm not really sure what I'm supposed to be doing and I can't see anything yet like in the hallways. And even if something did happen in the hallways, I feel like I couldn't even see it because it's so fuzzy. Uh, and there's all these weird dead animatronics hanging everywhere because this is a freaking Halloween costume thing that's happening that. Like, I don't even know, like, what I was supposed to be looking for. Let's let's check the vents, I guess. Uh, at least we don't have to worry about, like, a power thing this time. So, um... Okay, looks like we're safe, I guess. I mean, everything seems alright. I mean, I'm not too scared or anything yet. I feel like the second one did kind of scare me, though. The second one, like, made me nervous. I felt like I was doing a lot of stuff. Uh, to seal a, dent, uh, a vent, double-click the vent cam button. Oh, I see. Ah! Oh, okay. Uh, oh my god! Oh, 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 oh. Oh my god. Oh my god. I should have rebooted the ventilation. What am I doing? Stop it! Stop it! Let me let me let me reboot the ventilation. Oh, oh my god. Okay. No, don't play this game when it's dark. Like, when your whole room is dark. This this is really scary. Okay, so we got a game over. Let's do night two again, I guess. Uh, low game, night two. We're gonna beat night two, I swear. Uh, we're not gonna listen to this stu stupid face anymore. Uh, let's... Okay, let's, uh... Okay, yeah, we don't have to listen to the stupid face anymore. Hopefully. Yeah, okay. So, <laughs> let's, uh... Uh, oh my god, that scared the living balls out of me. I should have hit ventilation. That's what I did wrong. I should have hit ventilation. Um, 
<laughs> oh man, that was crazy. Ah, uh, dude, this game has definitely has the jump scare factor, especially if you're playing in a perfect environment. Normally things don't scare me, except for jump scares. I mean, or, okay, well, I was watching the Texas, the new Texas Chainsaw Massacre from like, I don't know, 2008 or something. I don't know when it was, but that was the newest one at the time. I don't know if they made one since then. And that, that movie wasn't scary as much as it like grossed me out. I had to leave the movie theater because like I was about to puke from all the, like the blood and stuff and everywhere. Uh, ventilation air, ventilation air. Uh, uh, yes. Okay. Woo. Yeah, baby. I'm good. I'm good at this game. I'm not, I'm not very good at this game. Actually, don't even listen to me. Uh, reboot all. Okay. Yeah. We'll just reboot everything. We're good. So you, so I see. So you have to worry about these systems right here and then you have to close off vents and then you can also play audio, I guess, maybe to distract the animatronic. Uh, yeah, I didn't add an S there, so a single one at the exit. Okay, so let's, uh, let's look right here. Uh, okay, so he's not coming through the vents. That's good. That's good. He's just kind of, like, chilling and doing his thing. Yeah, you just, you, you do whatever you do, man. You do you, and I'll do me, which means staying alive. It's fine. It's fine. We're good. We're good. We're fine. We're, we're cool. We're bros, right? We're bros, right? Yeah. Yeah, we're bros. It makes sense. That we'd only- Ah! Okay. Oh my god! Oh, okay, here. Uh, ventilation reboot! Reboot ventilation! Reboot ventilation! Oh my god. Okay. Whew. 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 Okay, reboot all. Reboot all. Reboot all. Oh my holy mother Mary of Jesus. <laughs> oh my god. Okay, we're good. We're good. We're fine. There's no need to freak out or anything. Okay, we're good. So we just need three more hours. Three, three more, or three more minutes, I should say. Okay, let's play the audio up here. I don't know if you have to play the audio, like, in the room that it's in, or you play it to distract them, like, far away. Because I feel like distracting them far away would make the most sense. Okay, so he's not in any of these. Let's do map toggle. Uh, let's check this side to seal a vent. So we don't have to seal any vents yet. It looks like that mechanic hasn't been brought in. Either that or it's just random and he hasn't done anything. So uh, I think we're good. Honestly, I think we're good. I think we won this night. Um. <laughs> oh, man. This freaks me out. This freaks me out so much. This is crazy. Do I need to just reboot the ventilation every so often? I'm not sure exactly how I'm supposed to be doing this. I don't- Ah! 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 Oh no. Oh no. I saw it in the mirror. It's like behind me. It's behind me. I don't want to look. I don't want to look. I'm scared. I'm scared. It, did, did you guys see it right here in the mirror? Oh no. Please don't do this. Don't do this. I think we beat this night though, hopefully. I think- Ah! Uh. Uh. uh, 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 uh No, get out of here, bro! Get out of here, dude! No, no. Um, um. Yes, yes. Anyways, I'm gonna call it here, guys. If you guys enjoyed this video and you want to see more, make sure to go and click the like button. It really helped me out. I love y'all's faces, and I'll see you for night three and four, I guess. Actually, let's play. Let's play this. Whatever this is, real quick. Okay. Uh, uh. Let's let's go right this time. Let's go right. It's fine. We're fine. We're good. We don't have to worry about dying and stuff. This is just a little mini game that explains the backstory. That is probably it. Oh my god. It's a torture chamber with little heads everywhere. You know, I can't wait to see the game theorists like video on this. I, I enjoyed their last ones. How like it was all those dead people. Um, I don't want to follow you. It's fine. It's fine. I don't. I'm not following you. Nope. Nope. Not doing it. No. Oh. Oh. So no matter which room I go to. He's going to be at that room. I don't want to follow you, though. There has to be, like, some kind of secret to this that I just don't know. Um, <laughs> I'm sure a bunch of you guys are going to tell me a bunch of tips and tricks on how to play this afterwards, and I would really appreciate it. Uh, it would really help me out so much. <laughs> oh, man. I'm... S oh, God. This is crazy. This is the kind of game you need, like, a face cam for or something. I feel like this is definitely something you need a face cam for. 
Because whenever I scream, it's not fake. I'm really, like, it really freaks me out. Oh my god, there's dead body. No, Freddy! Air? Here, wait, wait, let's, uh... Oh, you son of a biscuit. Okay, well, I'm gonna go ahead and call it there, guys.